So it's, uh, it's been pretty cool for Lindsay to have this extra time with both boys as well. Um, so yeah, been overall really big blessing for us to have this opportunity. Um, not gonna lie, I would like I kind of miss having a bit of personal space, like when she, um, when someone happens to be napping at the same time as the other person. Sometimes I miss a little bit of personal space, but um, those time that amount of time is uh, very little anyways. And I'm sure Lindsay would say the same. Like he would kind of miss having some personal space and time to socialize with other people at work but yeah like overall it's it's all going fine um we are still living in the same rental and i am dying to get out it's too small for all of us um the plane noise is annoying me the uh, look there's a few things that annoy me but we have a roof over our heads it's it's fine like we'll be okay but we are trying to move we're looking to move we're just waiting for the right place to pop up that ticks all the boxes um a lot of the houses around here are double stories with the living space upstairs and the yard downstairs which just doesn't suit me with two boys like jed loves playing outside i just i need them to be able to play on the same level of, as the living space um, so that's a big one with, yeah, finding it hard to find something that ticks all the boxes. Um, but I'm just crossing my fingers that something suitable pops up soon. There's no point us moving from here and just stepping sideways into something else that's just adequate. It doesn't have to be like a perfect home that we would want to live in. Like it's not going to be, it just has to be something that is helpful from a living perspective with kids and whatnot so we're just month by month renting here and waiting and hoping for something to pop up if something came up before christmas i would be over the moon um so yeah in terms of christmas plans we're just going to be here and uh we'll probably well we'll see my parents because they live close by no plans to go back to sydney at this point coronavirus situation is still all up in the air and also just from a planning and travel point of view with two little ones and one quite little one we it's just something that we're not looking into at the moment um what else can i tell you my paid parental leave has is just running out now so I'm about to start some more work to get to my, to get my business up and running again. So I'll have Sweet Tilly Flint, which will be selling um, wedding busy bags, but at, in a digital format. And I'll have Punchy, which is my editing business, but I'm going to have uh, going to be adding copywriting as a service. So if you need any proofreading, copywriting, or editing work, or you need some children's wedding activity packs if you're getting married those are two things that i offer and i'm going to pop some links below and i would love to help you out um i am finding it hard to have spare time to get all the stuff done that i want to do in my pockets of spare time but i am finding little moments here and there um so from a like postpartum perspective things are going pretty well last week i did have a little mini meltdown um i was having a bad day and i yeah jace is in leap four which if you know about leaps it's just um a developmental growth phase where they can get really clingy and fussy and trouble napping and stuff so I was having a tricky day in that regard, but also the house was a bomb and I've just figured out that I don't cope very well when the house is a bomb. There was just mess and on every available surface. And so I've been trying since then to figure out ways to make sure that I can stay on top of it a bit more and not feel guilty about 
um, like having Jace up on the bench in his rocker or not playing with him for a little bit or multitasking to keep on top of the housework because my philosophy I think is for me clean house equals happy mum equals happy kids I know that that's not the norm a lot of people say forget the housework put the housework aside just pay attention to your kids you're only young months and that is absolutely fine if you works for other people to live in complete chaos and mess great like if that works for you awesome doesn't work for me because it makes me feel out of control it makes me feel yucky it doesn't make me feel on top of things it makes me feel like a mess and it flows on to my positive attitude and then the way that I am with my kids so for me it is about balancing both obviously I play a lot with my kids I don't clean the whole time while they're awake but it's about balancing to make sure because having a tidy clean home is something that makes me feel better and that flows on so that's that's something but other than that it's been going quite okay um it's been an interesting few months of working through some emotions to do with um like size of family and like coming to terms with oh like last pregnancies and that whole phase of life being started and finished in an instant and like sort of questions around that like for me and it's been a bit of a roller coaster emotionally um but i am feeling pretty good right now um yeah we are still really happy with our decision to move the lifestyle up here suits us there's there's lots of things to do with young kids and we're finding that we have quite a few friends up here now that have actually moved up and we are loving how easy our like social life is it we've got lots of things that just happen sort of spur of the moment and it's sort of different to how it felt for us back in Sydney um it's just a, a, little, a lot easier for us here so being a really really good move and a year on we're very happy with the move um I think that's pretty much an update on everything and the boys will probably be back any minute now so I'm going to end it right here and just finish up getting dinner together. Um, Jace is going really well by the way, uh, he is a big boy but he's delightful and lovely, sleeps are going pretty good, we're just moving now into at four and a half months doing a little bit of light sleep training to help him self settle and link cycles and stuff. But other than that going really well or well, including that going well won't get into anything else right now because i do probably have one minute but thank you for watching if you've been watching this i hope i don't have dinner around my chin I probably do but um yeah thanks for watching and i hopefully will find another moment to do some other kind of update or video sometime soon all right bye